Sinus infections are one of the most common problems that patients come to see me for. And sinus infections uh, are sometimes difficult to treat. We try medications, we try decongestants, we try nasal sprays, and all of these can help. Um, but sometimes when we reach the end of our medical treatments, pa patients still have issues. This is where surgery plays a role. Traditional sinus surgery has been around for 100 years, and we do it all the time to help people improve their uh, sinus pressure and sinus infections and help them breathe better. Fortunately, today, we have new innovations that allow us to perform these sinus procedures in a minimally invasive fashion without general anesthesia, and patients do very well with minimal pain and recovery. In our office, we are able to perform these balloon sinus surgeries with the patients undergoing a mild sedation where they're very comfortable, the nose is numbed, and these sinuses can be opened with this balloon. The way this works is once the patient is comfortable, we're able to look in the nose with a camera and we use a small balloon catheter. This wire is threaded into the small openings of the sinuses. And then once the, balloon, the wire is threaded into the sinus, we can insert the balloon. The balloon is inserted over the wire into the sinus and then inflated. What this does is it stretches the normal opening of the sinus, which is usually very small, and makes it wider so that the sinus can breathe better. By opening up the sinus and letting it breathe better, mucus, pus, and other material that can get trapped in the sinuses are much more easily released, as well as the pressure in the sinuses is much more open. The sinuses that we can address are usually the ones under the cheeks, above the eyes, and in the middle of the head. All these sinuses can be addressed very easily in this simple procedure that we can perform in our office. Our patients have had great results, and all of them that have undergone this procedure have expressed their satisfaction with the whole process. They have no regrets that they didn't do it in the operating room under general anesthesia, and they're quite happy um, with the ease and the results of the, of the procedure.